defensive ends 97 Cameron Hayward 65, 295, Hayward missed time because of injury for the first time in his NFL career last season, so it will be good to see him on the field healthy. 91 Stephen Toot 66, 303, the biggest storyline of camp for Toot is whether he gets a contract extension. If he does, it will be for a boatload of money. 94 Tyson Ilulu 63, 304, an upgrade over Ricardo Matthews, who himself was an upgrade over Cam Thomas as the Steelers' top veteran backup defensive lineman. 96 LT Walton 65, 305, Walton gradually has worked himself into the rotation since being drafted in 2015. He seems to have a 2017 role secured. 95 Johnny Maxey 65, 283, last season as an undrafted rookie from Mars Hill, Maxey improbably made the active roster and even played a snap in a playoff game. 65 Levon Hook 63, 312, the Steelers keep bringing back Hooks in the hopes he can develop into something. There's some pedigree. 62 Francis Callan 65, 295, the Steelers used one of their pre-draft visits to meet with Callan, so there is obvious interest. Can he impress at St. Vincent 64 Christian Brown 63, 295, the WVU product comes with a reputation for athleticism for a man his size. He'll be looking to somehow stand out among a crowded mix. 61 Nelson Adams 63, 287, an undrafted rookie free agent with quite a hill to climb to make it to relevant roster contention. But the Steelers did sign him immediately after the draft. Defensive tackle 79 Javin Hargrave 62, 305, Hargrave has been one of the Steelers' better draft picks in the past few years, a third-rounder entering his second season firmly entrenched. 93 Daniel McCullough 67, 352, all but called out by his position coach on the team website last month, McCullers might be running out of time in Pittsburgh. He needs a good camp. 69 Roy Filan 63, 291, Filan originally was signed by the Steelers as an undrafted free agent in 2014. He keeps getting cut loose and brought back again. Outside linebackers 48 Bud Dupree 64, 269, Dupree's ascension to stardom could come in 2017, assuming it comes at all, of course. But just having him healthy in Latrobe is an improvement over 2016. 92 James Harrison 60, 242, this just has to be the final season for the great Harrison, the year he permanently loses his starting job, right right 90 TJ Watt 64, 252, even if Watt doesn't win a record 3 NFL Defensive Player of the Year awards like his brother, he still could be a dynamic pass rusher for years to come. 55 Arthur Motes 60, 246, Motes has been a model teammate and community member for 3 plus years. He's entering the final year of his contract looking for an on-field role. 56 Anthony Ciccolo 63, 255. Ciccolo has been okay in spot duty, and he tends to stand out in training camp settings. But at a crowded position, he'll be looking to make a splash in Latrobe. 99 Keon Adams 62, 245. An intriguing pick lead in the draft, Adams has some attributes that could be fun to watch during the preseason. He has quite the depth chart to scale, though. 41 Farrington Huganian 64, 268, the best name on the team, the former teammate of Dupree. Has upside. He was injured in Dolphins camp last season. Inside linebackers 50 Ryan Shazier 61, 230, although perhaps not with consistency injuries are a big reason why Shazier has been the dynamic playmaker the Steelers drafted him to be. 98 Vince Williams 61, 233, much attention will be paid to Williams as he enters camp as a starter for the first time. There's pressure in replacing longtime staple Lawrence Timmons. 44 Tyler Matakovich 61, 235, Matakovich was the special team stalwart he was expected to be as a rookie. Can he work his way into a regular role on the defense? 54 LJ Fort 60, 232, over the past 20 months, Fort has carved out a niche in the Steelers' locker room. But can he hold off younger players for his role? 51 Steven Johnson 61, 237, on his second one-year contract with the Steelers, Johnson hopes to remain healthy this time. Where does he fit? 46 Matt Galambo 61, 239, three-year starter at middle linebacker for pit profiles as the type coaches will appreciate. But it's a deep depth chart to navigate. 57 Keith Kelsey 60, 233, yet another tackling machine in college whose measurables don't project well to the NFL, Kelsey also could prove a positive presence on the practice field.
Safeties 23 Mike Mitchell 61, 221, hard to believe Mitchell is entering his fourth season with the Steelers and his ninth in the league. He hasnt missed a game since coming to Pittsburgh, 28 Sean Davis 61, 202, part of what one year in, appears to be a fabulous draft class, Davis was everything the Steelers could have asked as a rookie. 21 Robert Golden 511, 202, Golden's tenure as a starter lasted only a few weeks. But there's no shame in the role he has earned as a versatile top backup and special teams captain. 37 Jordan Dangerfield 511, 199, it's likely no one had played more preseason snaps for the Steelers on defense the past three years than Dangerfield. He finally cracked the 53 men in 2016. 30 Damian Stafford 61, 218, a quiet pickup late in the spring, Stafford started eight games for Dick Lebo's Titans defense the past two years. Will be interesting to see what his role is. 42 Jacob Hagen 63, 205, Hagen was a practice squad regular last season. Now he's hoping prove he can be part of the 53-man discussion. 39 Terish Webb 510, 190, another undrafted pit player, the Clareton product is a developmental prospect whom local fans will have their eyes on at camp. Cornerbacks 25 Artie Burns 60, 197, Burns has so far proven to be a solid first-round pick and the possible young, long-term number one CB the Steelers have been seeking for a long time. 31 Ross Cockrell 60, 191, Cockrell has been everything the Steelers could have asked for and more since he was a waiver claim in 2015. But he WASNT given a contract extension this spring. 22 William Gay 510, 187, now entering his 11th season, Gay had his role diminished last year. He has plenty of young challengers to fend off this camp. 20 Cameron Sutton 511, 188, Sutton is one of the players to watch most at camp because his possible role is so in flux. Look for him to return punts. 24 Cody Sensaba 511, 187, Sensaba had an interesting 2016 two teams, big contract twice let go, but he has a track record of being a solid veteran cornerback. 27 Senquez Golson 59, 176, first and foremost, Golson needs to stay healthy. If that happens, can he show second-round pick talent or has his opportunity passed by 29 Brian Allen 63, 215, another cornerback drafted, Allen is viewed more as a long-term, high-ceiling prospect than a 2017 contributor. But, oh, the potential. 35 Brandon Dixon 511, 203, the Steelers signed Dixon to the practice squad in December, his seventh organization over a 28-month span since being a 2014 sixth-round pick. 40 Mike Hilton 59, 184, a teammate of Golson's at Ole Miss, Hilton spent time with three organizations last season after going undrafted. He likely is only a candidate for the slot. 38 Greg Ducray 510, 183, Ducray has raw physical tools, but he only has played in nine regular season games over three seasons. Has an uphill climb. Chris Adamski is a Tribune Review staff writer. Reach him at Kadamski at tribweb.com or via Twitter at C underscore Adamskatrib.